Hello, TikTok. So I've been here to talk to you about something I'm being accused of that I find very horrible. And I just want to explain my side. And this actually will be the last that I actually discuss of this matter because what people are saying is 100% not true. Because what people are doing is blowing something so out of proportion and causing a lot of false outrage. And there's a lot of mob mentality that is following me from YouTube to this platform. Despite not liking me, <laughs> they seem to follow me instantly. It's always the haters who follow first. And while I don't want to give any more of my mental health to my haters because I've done this for many years and it's done nothing but destroy my own mental health further and just make things even worse. So the people from YouTube who have been trying to ruin my reputation with false outrage over on YouTube are now on TikTok trying to do the same thing, going as far as hashtagging animal abuser. So to make a long story short, recently I got married and moved to the Middle East to be with my husband, whom I fell in love with. I actually did a story about it on my YouTube channel, Foodie Beauty. Maybe some of you already are aware of me. I want to first say that I'm not perfect and I have said and done things that I'm not proud of in my past. I am trying to move past that. I do find that as I'm trying to better myself, that seems to anger people more and they try to bring me down more. So I'm a recent Muslim revert and I'm just trying to focus on Allah and my husband and my life here in Kuwait. I'm from Canada, by the way, if you don't aren't familiar with my story, there is a lot to unpack. But basically the allegations of animal abuse actually do hit home a little bit. I will not let it affect me anymore because I know in my heart that I do love animals and I've always taken care of my pets. I am highly villainized by a certain group of people who target me and I've been targeted for years in particular by one person who I will not name. I will not name the boogeyman. This person um, is very vile. They've been bullying and targeting me for years. Their entire YouTube channel is a hate channel that they pass off as valid criticism when they do nothing but call my mother a whore, um, go after my family. They mispronounce my Syrian husband's name Salah, which means prayer in Islam, by the way. They call him Salad, right in her thumbnails. I've reported it to YouTube many times, and they just do nothing.